Hi Gemini, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here for the rest of the year. Some of you, they're struggling when it comes to their finances here as well. Something that they've put, been putting in a lot of effort work into and it's not paying off. So they may be concerned about that. Um, they're not feeling in control of their finances or their life in general. Um, perhaps very busy, they have a lot going on here as well. Perhaps you're not on the same page, uh, Queen of Swords, King of Wands in reverse. It's almost you're looking in um, the opposite directions from one another. There's a lot of um, overthinking and pessimism coming through here. So you both seem to be doing your own thing. But this person, if there's separation, they don't want that here, Gemini. Although they are coming through as distracted, they still think about this quite a bit. Some of you in the past, this person was in and out of your life. Um, or coming through as emotionally unavailable or moody. So you never knew where you stood with them. I'm getting someone who's uh, scattered, right? And they scatter their energy. They don't take responsibility for their actions. And some of you, they were giving to more than one person. They were sneaky. They were juggling. So there's a lot going on in this person's overall energy. But Emperor in Reverse can be someone who's stubborn. They still have feelings for you and they don't want to be apart, but they, they're not changing their ways. Which is why I think your stance is Eight of Pentacles in Reverse, Four of Swords. I don't need clarity. I think you're straightforward here. You're not wanting to exert effort into this situation. And you're on a break here. Maybe I'll get one for the Four of Swords. Why is Four of Swords here for Gemini's stance? Yeah, you're not wanting to participate in this person's drama. You're wanting something that's equal here. An equal exchange of energy, you know, fairness, balance. Two people that are on the same page. And this person is coming through as a bit selfish here. So that is why you may have taken a step back from this situation, regardless of the attraction here, right? Yeah, the, the situation had you it's sleepless nights. It's thinking about something nonstop, right? It's always on your mind. So you're trying to heal from this situation is what I'm getting because it brings you a lot of anxiety. You may have removed yourself from this situation. How they're feeling, we have two of cups, page of pentacles. Well, there's a mutual admiration or they feel it's mutual and they have love for you. They're wanting to offer you a friendship here. So how they're feeling is they really like you. They like spending time with you and they do have emotion for you. Yeah, they think you're extremely attractive. Queen of Wands, they're physically very attracted to you. You may be someone who gets a lot of attention, or at least they put you on a pedestal here. Page of Pentacles again. Some of you would go to school or work with this person. That is another possibility. But there's definite physical and emotional attraction, and they are wanting to offer you a friendship here for the time being. For how they're acting, we have Hierophant, Ace of Pentacles in reverse, Queen of Wands upright. Some of them feel they don't have enough to offer you right now. Um, but they, hmm. let's clarify the Queen of Wands. So in terms of stability, I don't think they're quite there yet, but they're, they do have feelings for you and they are wanting to invest in you as a friend here. Why is Queen of Wands coming through? Yeah, some of you, ooh. It won't be for everyone, but there's three of pentacles, three of cups. Few of you, it may be someone else in their energy, which is why they can't offer you stability. But for others of you, they're acting, yeah, they're wanting to collaborate, they're wanting to work with you, and they enjoy your company. There's a friendship here. 
some of them may have wanted friends with benefits and that is you you took a step back and you're guarding yourself here i want to actually clarify why is eight of pentacles in reverse here for gemini stance why is eight of pentacles in reverse here separation heartache this situation brought you a lot of stress heartache which is why um, you're not wanting to exert any effort into this you're healing gemini further intentions we have nine of pentacles and high priestess in reverse clarify nine of pentacles in reverse there's codependency i was seeing the nine of cups in reverse as well But they have a decision to make. They're not listening to their intuition when it comes to this situation. Some of you, if they're in another connection, they're not single, which is why Nine of Pentacles in reverse. So it's logic over heart, right? They're trying to do what's right in this situation. So they're keeping you at arm's length, perhaps friend zoning you. And others of you, if there's no, you know, third, they're not committed, then it's dependent on you emotionally but they don't show you this and they're guarded they hide their feelings this is someone who's trying to listen to their mind right they're not paying attention to their intuition but whatever's happening this person feels left out because there's no forward movement and some of you no communication no contact and that has this person feeling restless is what I'm getting. Yeah, because they don't know what, what you're up to. They're almost losing patience. They're giving up on this situation. Stubborn rigid, stubborn rigid energy is what I'm getting from this person. Emperor in reverse, king of swords, strength in reverse. Not paying attention to their intuition, ignoring their feelings, trying to act detached but they do have love for you so don't be fooled by this exterior they have going how you're feeling we have knight of pentacles ten of wands three of cups in reverse yeah you're not really rushing anything here knight of pentacles is sometimes stagnancy where you're standing in one position but your stance is you're not ex you're not putting effort into this some of you felt the situation was a burden with the three of cups, you're not coming together. Some of you have to deal with this person because of work and that is the only reason you associate with them. But you're slowing things down and that is how you're feeling. You're not moving towards them. Perhaps this didn't get past the friendship phase and that's sort of where it's stuck right now. In your outcome, Gemini, you have a decision to make. Two of swords, seven of pentacles. You're sort of taking a step back and assessing here in your outcome, um, whether you want to invest into this or if you're going to abandon this. So yeah, your outcome is it's sort of up in the air. You haven't made up your mind here. For this person's outcome, we have Moon in Reverse, Queen of Pentacles, Eight of Cups, Ten of Swords, Five of Swords in Reverse. Well, they have no choice um, because you, there things are at a standstill between the both of you. Right? And this person is not taking any significant action towards you. So you may divert your attention to yourself, which I saw in your overall stance. And as a result, this October, we have Ten of Pentacles, Hermit, Knight of Swords. So I do see reconciliation here. Um, after a period of perhaps no contact with the Hermit. And this person is coming towards you with communication, Knight of Swords. So yeah, things are stuck right now, but they will be moving forward here. Uh, moving into October, so I don't think this is a permanent break. Gemini, it's temporary. Although I'm scared, I'm more scared to lose you. I fear you're going to find someone better if I don't get it together soon. Yeah, 
Well, didn't I tell you this person feels their life's a bit scattered or they're a mess with the emperor? They feel they don't have things under control. So they're trying to sort out um, their perhaps home situation. I love my family. I'm trying not to get too attached to you. So it can be family, friends are getting in the way. Some of you, this person was committed and they were juggling, but they're in love with you. That is also coming through here. Queen of Pentacles can also be a wife, right? Because we do have the Queen of Wands twice and we have Queen of Pentacles. I came alive in your presence like I was on top of the world, bringing out the best in me. I don't feel good enough for you. You can do so much better and yet you are here loving me. So yeah, some self-worth issues coming through as well. Feeling like they don't deserve you. This person loves the way you make them feel. They felt they felt attractive in your presence is what I'm getting. Hmm. Yeah, so in the outcome, they may have to withdraw because of a third energy, um, Queen of Pentacles. But if it's if that's not the case, it's your inaction that's causing them to, they have no choice but to remove themselves, right, for the time being. We have circumstances. I didn't want to reveal what's been really going on in my life and unload all my personal issues on you. I just want it to be left alone. So yeah, there may be something to do with their family here is what is coming through and some of you immature if this person has ghosted we have i ghosted you because i wanted to teach you a lesson i'm emotionally attached to someone else i didn't know how to tell you that may be their past energy there can be three people here but they're attached to you with the two of cups I don't want to be judged for who I am. Okay. I'm afraid you will hurt me. A lot of fear getting in the way as well. I'm afraid I will bore you. Yeah, this person thinks they don't have enough to offer you. You're too good for them. They put you on a pedestal. That is what I'm getting here. And you do have power over them with I'm afraid you will hurt me. Their emotions are with you with the two of cups, right? They're vulnerable when it comes to you. So yeah, you do have power over them and you can hurt them. And they are afraid of that. They're afraid of the control you have over them, Gemini. Gift. I love this card. You may be surprised by someone's act of kindness. Be open to small gestures or any proposals that come your way. Embrace the gift. Someone may be giving, coming to you with an offer, a gift. Uh, it's almost what I'm getting here. Someone here was juggling or they were flighty with the Knight of Wands, Six of Pentacles. The situation was unfair, but there's a message here with the Page of Wands. Some flirting, someone sending you a message. And there's potential here with Judgment and Empress to expand, to grow. Some of you, I am seeing pregnancy come through, so be careful. But yeah, there's a page of wands energy coming through. It's more lighthearted, flirty. It can be this person coming through, but it can be a new energy. But just be open to any new possibilities here as well. I want one more for your advice here. What advice for Gemini? Casual. If casual dating is not your thing, it might be time to look elsewhere. This person has no intentions on settling, di settling down anytime soon. It's up to you. Yeah, so they may be. Because it, for how they're acting, we had Hierophant and Ace of Pentacles in reverse. They're not taking responsibility, which I mentioned. And they're not bringing stability your way. They are offering a friendship. Some of you, they're dating around. So that is why maybe it's saying um, get to know new. Page of Wands is always ready for an adventure, right? It's exploring new territory. So that is what I'm getting for you, Gemini. Let's get you this deck as well.
Okay, guardian angel. Your prayers are being answered in the perfect way. Everything is happening exactly as it should for the highest good of everyone concerned. And we have take a chance. Being passionate about something can inspire you to take risks. Go for it. As long as you understand the difference between taking a risk and being reckless. Some of you, it's taking a leap. Something to do with money, finances, some creative or financial endeavor here. And it's telling you to go for it. But it's calculated risks, right? So they're wanting you to think about it and go for it sort of plan strategize if it's in regards to finances because i was seeing the fool and two of pentacles and in your outcome you're sort of weighing here right the pros and cons of doing something and others of you it's about um getting to know new energies in terms of your love life right so it really depends on your situation but yes gemini that is what i have for you if you would like a personal reading the info will be in the description box otherwise take care of yourself and i will see you next week bye